Netflix is Don speaking. How can we help you tonight? Uh, yes, I just have um, a suggestion about your guys' uh, about your guys' services. Yeah, what? Um, well, see, uh, I I do recall that you guys used to have a few movies that were for adult entertainment purposes, and I, I don't I have a lot of time myself, and I was just wondering uh, when you guys will return certain titles. You said when we were trying certain titles. Well, I remember I used to oh, you, said, you, uh -huh. you used to have a title called Captain Stabbin, and I watch that actually rather frequently. Frequently, and I'm just wondering why these titles keep being removed from Netflix. Yeah, because I mean we're constantly updating because we have you know adding on newer content, and we go like uh, you know pretty much based on the views of you know. Our mm -hmm. members worldwide is kind of like voted on the scene. You know, oh, I was a big fan. Of, I was I was a big fan of Captain Stabbing, and it's just disappointing to see the man leave. So I was so it when's when's your how often do you guys update movies such as? I mean, yeah, it's updated daily. So I mean, we're constantly we constantly updating content daily? every each and every day. Now, what all categories? So, do you, I mean, what all categories do you have? I'd like you to name off the categories for me, please. Yeah, what all categories do we have? Yes. Just all right, do you have an account with us? Uh, well, I just like to know the categories, sir. Just do you have? Yeah, any... we have like horror, comedy, action. You action. know, like your basic categories: what drama, you, like what kind thrillers, of thrillers, suspense. Do you need action, like as an action in bed with women, or action as in too fast, too furious? I, cause you guys used to have a lot of... Yeah, I mean, I'm not... I mean, I can only, like, say what genres we have, but, I mean, I can't explain as far as the movies, cause, I mean, I, I don't categorize... I, we don't, I don't, like... I, searched, I don't sort them out into, you know... What kind I, of I, I searched for the adult category multiple times, sir, and I, I couldn't find anything that was relevant towards my searches. And I just think that you guys should update the site accordingly. An adult category? To an adult category, yes, sir. Like to see that on there, like a adult category? Yes, I, it's a suggestion. I, I remember there being a certain adult category. I brought it up multiple times. It was known as Captain Stabbin, and I cannot find Captain Stabbin. It was the only thing I bought Netflix for, so that way I could look up certain adult titles without having to clear my computer history every three hours. And I was just thinking that it would be a nice suggestion, not a nice add-on to the, to the packages that Netflix provides, and it would be more than appreciated. Is that like an adult film? Is that like a... Uh, like, what is, what is, yes. what is Captain Stabbing? What is that? What was that? What kind of movie is that? Captain Stabbing, it's a man, it's a, it's a sailor-oriented film. And, uh, Captain Stabbing. And I, I like there to be an adult category. Have you ever seen some Cinemax? You know, there would, there would occasionally be a late at night Cinemax and, yeah. All the stuff they show on there. I'd like there to be a category for it. I think you should pay extra though, that because I don't want my children watching Captain Stabbing. But I, right. I think it would. I think it would be a good addition. I think you guys could actually. It'd be a proper investment for you guys. I mean, I could definitely pass it along and you know, get that over to our content team so they can take a look into it and hopefully add in that feature. Yes, cause I always just say uh, just to check back on it. You can always send in requests too. If you go to our website, uh, uh, go to Netflix, and then you see, because you actually you'll be able to send it in, you'll be able to get a response back. Cause I uh, am in that, yeah, cause I. Uh, yeah, if you go to uh, about where it says about us, so like if you're on your computer and uh, you log in your account, go to where it says about us. Now, do you guys have? And a when you're on that page. Mm -hmm. Now, do you guys have a child? Proof sort of system, like a code, for example, for movies that I don't think would be appropriate for my children to view. Uh, they have a virtual controlling, oh, which allows right. you to like block certain rates, like rated R movies. Yes, and Captain Seven. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's a parental control system to block those certain titles. Mm -hmm. Yes, and how does this parental control work? Do you just do you need a code, or is it just? Yeah, you need to, like, for instance, if your child was, like, you weren't around and your child trying to go to watch something that you didn't approve of and you had it part of control on it, yeah. they would actually have to put the password for your account, like, just the regular password that you log in with. So if they didn't know 
have that password, then they wouldn't be able yeah. to, you know, unblock it to where they can actually watch it. Because if you guys are adding in an adult section, I don't want my kids getting a hold of, you know, gushing granny or anything like that, you know. Right. Yeah. Well, uh... So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. No, I was just going to say uh, about the site as well. I mean, you can always, as far as, you know, being that feature that you want to see, you always be able to go in there and, you know, get feedback as far as, you know, certain features and also titles and movies that you like to see as well. Sounds good. Because I am really looking forward to see Captain Stab him back on air. I've been searching the internet constantly and I never can find him. I figured Netflix would be the best resort to find films such as Gushing Granny, Captain Stabbin, Werewolf in London, you Shut Your Mouth Before I Fuck It, you know, all those. I'm really looking forward to this. Oh, wow, okay. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, I guess we passed out of all again. I mean, I have hopes to get him back on. I just wouldn't be able to get your response time. Yeah. So that's why I said it'd be better uh, if going on the site where you go to About Us and then Contact, and then it uh, lets you put in your email address, email. You know, uh, it has the subject fields where you type in as far as, you know, your questions and concerns and yeah. as far as, like, you know, my, any requests that you have. My, my wife is going through severe menopause, and the adult category would just be such an improvement in my life. <laughs> you know? I mean, Gushing Granny, man, that movie was incredible. So much gushing. I mean, we have hopes of getting those back on there for you. I mean, All right. you know, going through those rough times, you know, you got your titles back. Yeah. Yeah. All Some right, source man. of entertainment, at least. <laughs> yeah. All right, man. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing Captain Stabbing back. All right. Well, we uh, hope to get that back on there for you soon. And just one thing before you go, if you wouldn't mind, please yeah. down the line for one question survey. Okay, go ahead. Thanks for staying on the line. In order to serve you better, we would love to hear about your experience with Netflix. If you are satisfied, press 3. If you are dissatisfied, press 4. Uh, well, I guess they didn't have Captain Stabbin, so... I think I'll press... I'm sorry, but I did not understand your response. Press... If you are satisfied, I... press 3. If you are dissatisfied, we are sorry to hear you are dissatisfied with your Netflix experience today. Thank you for taking the time to provide us with feedback. Goodbye. Yeah. That went well. Captain Seven.